For this operation, you will need circlip pliers, a size 5 hex key, and a size 4 hex key. Flat blade screwdrivers might also be useful, as we will see later. Unscrew the four screws of the hand wheeled clutch cover using the appropriate hex key and remove them. You can pull on the hand wheel to remove the cover and, if needed, you can also use a flat blade screwdriver as a lever. You have now removed the cover that will be replaced with the new one. Using the appropriate hex key, remove the hand wheel and its keyway from the cover and put them to the side. Now you can access the tapered bushing. With the pliers, first remove the circlip, then the bushing. Now you can place the new keyway and position the new tapered bushing. With the pliers, place the new circlip and make sure that everything is secured. Before installing the new hand wheeled clutch cover, make sure that its spring is correctly positioned as seen here. Now, place the new cover and screw the four screws diagonally with the appropriate hex key. Do not screw too tightly, simply bring the screw in contact with the cover as seen here. Now you can place back the hand wheel and screw it with the appropriate hex key. Turn the hand wheel to make sure that it is driving the shaft correctly. If it doesn't, then start the procedure again. If everything works correctly, then the procedure is finished. 